Andy Dean. He's the former president of Trump Productions and worked with Mr. Trump for seven years. Andy, thank you for being here tonight. So, thank you. What is officially the defense being offered by the Trump campaign on this? Well, look, I, I think it was a question that was asked at a town hall forum, and Don, as you can tell, kind of shrugged his shoulders and laughed a little bit because it was a pretty aggressive question. But as far as what Donald thinks, I mean, we all know that President Obama went to Reverend Jeremiah Wright's church. And what religion that is, I, I'm not sure because we remember Reverend Wright saying, Goddamn America, that's in the Bible. I've read the Bible, I have not seen that passage yet. So I think more than anything, there's just confusion on our end as to why one tiny question is some sort of big media controversy right now. You know, it's. It's because the guy, well, a couple reasons. Number one, he seemed to be condemning Muslims as a group as opposed to radical Muslims. Number two, he said that Barack the Obama... The questioner was, not Donald Trump. Yeah, the the questioner. questioner was, not Donald Trump. Well, the, right, Correct. exactly. And then number two, he said, the questioner, that Barack Obama is a Muslim and that he's not a citizen of this country. And Donald Trump did not correct him well, or we, challenge him on either We know one. he's a citizen... Well, that's not correct. We know that Barack Obama is a citizen of this country. One of the reasons why we have definitive proof is that Donald Trump got Barack Obama's long-form birth certificate. Why didn't he say and that? And once he produced that, there's been no controversy since. And it is, it, Megan, for a second here, it's pretty impressive if you look at Donald Trump's pure negotiating skill that nobody on planet Earth was able to produce this document until Donald turned this so into an in issue. So then he's in the best position to turn Obama around to that man the document. and say, we know he's a citizen, sir. We know that because I pushed for him to release it, and he did. And that, and that question has been resolved, period. Let's move on. Okay. Well, Megan, he could have said that, but by that exact same logic, think of this. Why didn't Barack Obama, according to that same logic, stand up at Jeremiah Wright's church and say, hey, Jeremiah, well, that's a not deflection. goddamn America. That's America a isn't. No, it's the exact same thing. No, it point. isn't. Barack What's Obama's not running for office. Donald Trump is. Sorry, he wasn't running for office in 2007. And in he, 2003, see, Jeremiah Wright office. didn't say that. He won the office, and he's now the sitting president. So we, Correct. We, that, that, that fish has swum. <laughs> that ship has sailed. Okay, and well, it's a, parallel, it's a parallel argument. Megan, I'm sorry. This well, that's is a, deflection, a rough night, that I guess. Deflection. I, that's not making any sense. That's a deflection. It's not a deflection. With, it's with an exact parallel. Well, you seem to be dodging. Are you uncomfortable on this issue? Why can't you answer whether... What is it, Megan? Please get specific. I, okay, I will. Why didn't Donald Trump okay. look at him and say he is not a Muslim, he is an American citizen, I'm the man who made him produce his birth certificate? I think that could have been an answer as to why, you know, when Donald's answering questions at a town hall, he doesn't give the perfect politically correct answer at every moment to satisfy the media. You know, I, I, I'm not a genius. I can't figure that out. That's okay. That's a reasonable response. All the stuff about Thank why didn't you. Barack Obama stand up is a deflection. We got to it eventually. No, Andy, it's not. It was an exact par it's an, a parallel argument, actually, okay. Megan. And when we rewatch this, we'll see that. Okay, <laughs> I'll look great. forward to Let's doing just that later. Joining me now with more